Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. I can't tell you how excited... Well, I'll just tell you how excited I am right now. I'm so excited. This is amazing. It's amazing that they even fit on here, right? And it's also amazing when I tell you this is some of the music department here at Cupertino High School. So there's a lot more instrumentalists uh, that we, we just couldn't fit. So we just... Well, you won't be hearing them this evening. Uh, you'll have to come back on April. It's on the back of your program. Without further ado, uh, here's this amazing American music, African American spirituals. Um, it's a singular, amazing um, music that came out, came out of slavery, with a, mixed in with Christianity, um, and how this powerful music um, can be so joyful and amazing and powerful and hopeful, hopeless. Um, there's just adjective after adjective. Um, to describe this music. Um, it's been around for, you know, hundred and so years now, um, and it's never fallen out of popularity because the universal emotions that you're going to hear uh, in all these pieces uh, in the stories um, are pretty amazing. The words had a double meaning. Uh, they had a, a meaning, meaning maybe um, in religious form, but also literal meaning. So when I was um, hoping for a better place, I was thinking north. Um, I'm going to cross over to campground. Uh, so these are a lot of metaphors here. Um, I'm so proud of the, the sounds you're going to hear this evening and how each of the soloists and the choir and the orchestra and the instrumentalists are going to bring um, this amazingly powerful music uh, to you this evening. So uh, uh, enjoy. Uh, feel free. Normally with classical music, uh, we would hear all seven numbers and then we clap at the end but I know you're not going to be able to control yourself. Um, so feel free to clap at the end of each, uh, at each song. And so without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, a lot of the music department presenting uh, John Butter's Feel the Spirit.
sometimes I feel like a motherless child alone from home alone from home
on that mountain, my Lord spoke. Out of his mouth came fire and smoke.
Secret harp. It's a it's a horizontal harp. You've never seen it before. It's pretty amazing. So if you're wondering where that was came from. <sighs> like I said, this is some of the music department. Where's the other part? The guy who got this orchestra in shape to play awesome uh, for you this evening, Mr. I. Where are you? Get on up here. Get on up here. Thank you. Go.
possible tonight if it wasn't for our amazing choir director, Mr. Aaron. Ladies and gentlemen, one man does not make a concert. Uh, about 300 people make a concert. Uh, there's people in the dark that are making the per people in the light look really good and sound really good. I didn't tell you before, so you were, you were listening to it. But if you'll notice uh, the world's worst auditorium uh, for singing, do you see how the choir's in a different room? It's just a big door right there. And the orchestra is in your room. And so... Some Las Vegas magic has been happening this evening to get their sound to you at the same time as the uh, orchestra happens. And that's our sound man back there, David Sandwich. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Also hiding in the dark back there, uh, we have no proof that this happened, unless you filmed illegally, of course. Um, so, uh, so we have no proof this happened if uh, Chris didn't film it and Orrin didn't turn the lights on. Chris and Orrin for lighting. And um, we bring in some professionals um, pretty much on a daily basis to influence. That's why you're hearing the music so musical and so just like amazing um, this evening. And they are the glue that's in, in between both rooms right now, um, and I'm the most lucky choir, con choir conductor in the world that these people come in and they play for our students. It's Dr. Strick and Mrs. Wan for the first time together on a concert. If you're over 25, you can't see the little asterisks that are in the program. Uh, but these people, um, on a daily basis, they're doing like so many jobs, um, and I, I would never see my children if it weren't for my TAs. TAs? Will you raise your hand back there? TAs that help me every day and do a hundred jobs? TAs, come on now, get them up top. Please, please. Ladies and gentlemen, there's nothing more fun uh, than doing music, but doing music with everybody. So we're just going to start a song, and I'm going to turn around, and you just show me where all this talent came from. Are you ready? Let's do a little sing. Should we play a little more? Should we sing just, yeah. Yeah. just a tiny bit more? Oh, yeah. Aren't they amazing? I, mean, I tell you, let's just, I'm going to go visit some high schools. I'm telling you, this is so un, unexpected. It's so extraordinary. Um, 
most schools don't even have an orchestra. Bay Area, we have orchestras. Um, Mr. I and I are so proud, so proud. Um, we wave our arms, but they make it sound uh, so great. So, so, one more time, ladies and gentlemen, the Cupertino High School Music Department. Thank you very much for seeing us.